real poet, bring the drums in. The universe is expanding, the universe keeps growing. I reached the end of the universe, said fuck it, and kept going. Kept going, kept going. For trillions upon trillions upon trillions of miles, there was nothing, there was no one, there was no one, there was no one. And then I saw a house, and I looked inside the house, and sitting there was a man, there was a man. And sitting next to the man was a woman. They were smiling, they were holding each other's hand, each other's hand, each other's hand. And the closer that they grew, I realized the couple was me and you. And I had one question I could ask. Did this moment happen in the future or the past? All I want to do is travel to another universe. I'm probably the weirdest fucking person on the stupid earth. I've never been accepted by the people that are normal. So I'm slipping through a stargate, man. I'm leaving through a portal. Cause I'm socially so awkward. I'm emotionally bonkers. And I'm hoping that I'm not another ghost in the apocalypse. I don't need any oxygen to breathe them in the essence of a technicolor. I'm the present demon in his presence. And I got a lot of memories that hurt me when I think about him. Hands are full of blisters. I was climbing up the steepest mountain. Every time I tripped into the bottom, I just fell again. And he has a flower in a garden full of skeletons. And every time a wound appears, I keep it like a souvenir. I dip my pen into it like there's gotta be some truth in here. The cause and the effect is that I'm constantly affected by the cost of your affection and your condescending messages. A comedy, the misery, the convoluted. The memories, the constellation, symmetry, the coffin that you built for me, the Odyssey, the Iliad, the oddities, the pyramids, the harmony of spirits when the bond is truly fearless. And I'm probably the weirdest fucking person in this galaxy. My head is getting heavy, full of misery. You'd have to use a guillotine to even out the chemical of ballast. So decapitate my crown and you send me in the salads. And my feet are just so horribly callous because I'm bleeding the aurora borealis. And I'm hoping for some meteors to pour me on showers because I feel so fucking lonely. I'm performing in a theater alone when no one's gathered. And I'm probably the weirdest fucking person in the history of history. I'd sell the key to heaven just to get to be alive for a moment where I don't feel scared. That if I died right now, you wouldn't care. Now you wouldn't care. Now you wouldn't care.